Hello my lovely students welcome once again to Dr. Saurav sir's classes today we will continue again with group theory theory part is continuing students parts where you have to learn where you have to study but not memorize remember memorizing is not the way to do mathematics study learn understand and keep it in your brain okay so today's topic you can already see what are the to i mean what are the topics that i'm going to do in this series of the videos you can check them out it's already given over here okay so let's start ticking them the first thing that we are going to do on group theory theory part will be the coset part we're going to talk about cosets talk about about cosets okay giving some of course examples as well all right then we are going to talk about some properties of cosets in this series of videos some properties some properties and also I, of course important ones okay then we'll talk about the index of a subgroup okay what is the index index or the power right of the subgroup then we'll talk about a very important part very very important market star abelian group what is an abelian group then we'll talk about equally important what is a non-abelian group okay equally important students okay and then we'll learn about some important rules okay some important rules on abelian groups important rules very important rules okay student very very important rules you want to mark that also a star will give you examples on these mathematical examples are very very important very very much required okay for us to understand this part so let's move on to the first definition students what is a coset let h be a subgroup of g okay so h the h is a subgroup of g it's already a subgroup of g okay s g of a group g where g is the group okay where g is the group all right let h be a subgroup of g then for any a the set h a such that h a is given in the set okay and h belongs to the uh, set as of the subgroup a is called the right coset this h a is the right coset right coset so you can easily understand there will be two cosets one is the right coset then there has to be a left coset as well of this is the right coset of h of the group g and the set a h that is given as a h is called the left coset of h a h is the left coset so there are two cosets one is the right and the other one is the left the right one is h a the left one is a h all right very very simple about coset okay very very simple students nothing difficult about coset okay so there will be a left coset and there will be a right coset okay h of course h you will be multiplied with an h okay a h some element a some element h such that h will belong to the uh, subgroup h okay now uh, moving on uh, uh, to some properties on coset students some uh, very very important properties on cosets okay what are the properties on cosets let us understand some properties on cosets let g be a group okay capital g all right that is a printing mistake capital g is a group let g be a capital uh, I mean let uh, capital G be a group not G be a capital group okay uh, let capital G be a group 
and H be a subgroup of G and A comma B belongs to the group G. If this happens, then you will have the first option that what you will have is H A will be equal to H. All right, that implies is A belongs to H. Next, H A will be equals to H B. Okay, students. Okay. So, what is the first one? The first one says that H A, okay, H A will be equal to H. That means A will belong to the uh, subgroup H. Okay. Next one, H A will be equal to H B. Okay. That is a. That means A B inverse will be belong to H. When you do A into B inverse, when you do A into B inverse or A B inverse, okay, will belong to H. All right. Now the third one says what? If A H is equal to B H, that means A inverse B will belong to A inverse B will belong to H. What? If A H is equal to B H, that is equivalent to A inverse B will belong to H. These are some properties of cosets, students. You need to go ahead and you know write these properties down in your notebook go through them once again twice thrice four times if it's uh, necessary okay but make sure you go ahead and read these properties and study okay and understand okay how this is happening all right how how is it how is it happening okay okay students you need to understand okay okay now uh, let's say if uh, uh, but I, I I want to give you an example of a coset. Like like let's say like um, uh, all these things are okay when it is in uh, theory, right? When it is T H E O R Y theory. But what about the question? What happens if you have a question? Let's give you an example, a small example. Let's say let's say there is a group G which is equal to Z four, all right? Z four, and uh, there is a subgroup H. Let's say. And the elements are say 0 comma 2 okay and uh, of course G is uh, denoted by uh, let's say G is denoted by the binary operation plus all right and then uh, the core set has to be written as H plus X right H plus X so how are you going to do then you're going to get H is equal to right you're going to get h is equal to h plus uh, say 0 then h is equal to h plus say 2 right and uh, both ways you're going to get 0 comma 2 right 0 comma 2 ah, isn't it and uh, if you do this if you do h plus 1 now what will you get you will get equal to which is h plus 3 right equal to h plus 3 so then what do you get you get 1 comma 3 right this is 0 comma 2 these are the elements 1 comma 3 okay so like that you can find the cosets like that if you if i if, if, I, if this is the example that you will follow so you can see how we are finding the cosets will be found in this way. It will be given in the question to you that the coset has to be found in this way. So you can see these are the x values x1, okay, x2. All right, students. Okay, students. So I believe the concept of uh, you know uh, cosets uh, is clear to you. The concept of this, the properties of cosets. How how uh, you are getting this? as in h plus 1 and h plus 3 so these are the x values in the in the in the set you're going to get 1 and 3 because you remember it was like hx right hx something like that right the core set uh what is it here here you go ha right 
सो एच ए राइट को सेट और ए एच लेफ्ट को सेट सो सिमिलर वे एच ए एच एक्स यू कैनॉट राइट हियर राइट सिंपली बिकॉज इट इज द एडिशन एच प्लस एक्स सो एनी वे स्टूडेंट दैट सेट फॉर दिस पार्ट ऑफ ग्रुप थ्योरी वी विल कंटिन्यू दीज वीडियोज इन द नेक्स्ट पार्ट ओके so you keep taking as much help as possible from uh, sort of sales classes because all the help that you'll be needing will be provided here at sort of sales classes thank you for watching students